Hey, what's up guys? So today I'm going to show you a really quick way to transfer your Steam games over from your old computer to your new computer without using the internet or anything. And all you're going to need is an external hard drive to do this. So uh, the first thing you're going to do is go to your computer and locate your Steam folder. It's probably under Program Files 86, down to Steam, down to Steam Apps, go to Common, and here's going to be all of your game folders. Then all you got to do is you're probably going to want to do all your games, but obviously that's going to take me a really long time, so I'm just going to do uh, one game, and you can put them in a folder if you want, but I'm just going to throw one in here, so let's just do this one. Just put it in here, it'll have to copy it over, should be relatively quick. And then uh, from there, what you're going to do is you're going to go over to your new computer. Obviously, I'm not going to switch computers to do this, but imagine, you know, I'm, I'm switching over to my new computer so then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go on the new computer go to this same folder after installing Steam then you're gonna go into the common folder and it's all gonna be empty for you and then you're just gonna drag your games into here now, I already have it so I'm not gonna do that but um, it's gonna take a while probably to copy them all over and then once you do it you should have something that looks like this with all of your game folders in it now that's relatively simple to do but where people a lot of people get stuck is they go into steam and all of the games aren't highlighted because and they have this little like install thing here and then you go to install it and it says oh well estimated download time and all this stuff and you're like I don't want to re-download it because some of these games you know are really big and are going to take a really long time to re-download um, what you want to do is just install it and and just ignore it it's going to start downloading it but it'll basically recognize instantly that you have all of those files already and it's going to just skip the download now what it is doing right now is it is going to update the game because um, that's just what it does as soon as it as soon as it finds that the game needs to be updated it's going to start to update it um, but you don't have to re-download the whole entire game and if you want you can cancel that and you know stop the download it's, and right here if you want to do that as well so that's just you know a really simple way and then once that downloads done I will be able to play it and yeah you just have to do that for all of your games it is gonna be really quick to do because it just has to install them it doesn't have to download them and so it should be really simple to do in just a few seconds so yeah hopefully that helps you guys and let me know if you have any questions in the comments and I'll do my best to answer them and other than that thanks for watching and I'll see you guys later.